Kriyenya, hello kay mga in-earag. So today is another day, another Sunday. So ayan na, eto na ang vlog natin. But first, kumain na ba kayo? It's 12pm, so kain na kayo, okay? Okay, magpalitas kasi mahal ko kayo and dapat kumakain kayo ng mabuti, okay? And always eat healthy foods, please, please. Lalo na ngayong pandemic na kailangan malusog tayo. So take care of yourself, prioritize yourself, love yourself, okay? Okay, so today we're gonna talk about something na kailangan nyo malaman. Ano kaya yun? Hmm. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna talk about do's and don'ts ng MLOVES, fans, wota, or kahit ano, basta fan kayo ng certain idol, or celebrity, or group, basta kahit ano. So ayun, if hindi pa kayo napapansin ng osyo nyo, makinig lang kayo sa mga tips ko. Baka mapansin na kayo ba? <laughs> But yeah, hindi naman super hirap na mga sasabihin ko. But I hope it can help you and can serve you as a guide para maging mas happy and safe ang fandom na to. Okay? So I'm gonna give you 5 do's and 5 don'ts. So total of 10. Ah, <laughs> but! <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna start with the do's. So number 1 is, of course, always be nice. Hindi lang dahil idol kami, but of course, we also deserve respect. Hindi porket celebrity, idol, artista, ay hindi na namin nararamdaman yung mga sadness. Kapag nababash kami, kapag may nasasabi kayong mali, it's always nice to know na you are one of the people who are inspiring your Osho, diba? So, syempre, always be nice. The more nicer you are, the more na ma-appreciate namin kayo. It's okay to send constructive criticism, of course, para makatulong sa amin, para mag-improve. But, of course, beware and be cautious sa mga sinasabi nyo. Be careful kasi there are certain things na hindi naman dapat kailangan sabihin. For example, I point out yung mga flaws namin na hindi naman namin mag magagawa ng paraan. Hi. Mahingay ba? Oh my. Oh my. Ang ingay. Please, kapag may narinig ko yung ingay, huwag nyo lang pansinin kasi I can't do anything about kids who are playing. <laughs> but yeah, number two ay something na makakalimutan natin minsan kapag umaasenso na tayo o kaya we know we did something amazing, ganon. But it's important to always stay humble. So number two, stay humble because it's not always about the money or how long you stayed as a fan. Hindi mo naman pagmamayari ang mga idols or anyone who you idolize. Kaya always stay humble. Know the boundary. Know your limits. Wag niyong ipagpilitan. Kasi hindi naman ganun yun. Always be humble. Wag kayo magyabang ng magyabang kahit na feeling nyo may iyayabang kayo. It's better to be known as humble kesa naman sa may abang, diba? So, stay humble. Hindi porket feeling mo nakaangat ka na ay nakaangat ka talaga kasi we're all pantay-pantay. Wow! <laughs> Napaka-kawad niyo! So, let's move on to number three. So, number three is appreciate the small efforts. Super, super important nito kasi nakabush siya ng confident, nakakatuwa kapag may nakapansin. Simple effort tulad ng kung nag-ayos ka men, nagustuhan nyo, yung hair, yung makeup, yung damit. If you say something you like, try to compliment her or us or anyone para may pagpatuloy namin. Alam nyo yun, kapag nalaman namin na yun pala yung gusto nyo, mas makakapag-adjust kami and we can know, we know how to cater you lalo. So, Always appreciate the small efforts and let her know, let us know, let them know. Because <laughs> it's gonna help us a lot. And, of course, you're gonna benefit from it. Kasi, kayo rin yung makakuha ng mga future good things from us. And of course, I appreciate din naman natin yung mga fans natin na super, super, super effort sa lahat-lahat ng events namin. Na present lagi sa events. Because... That takes a lot of effort and we appreciate you guys. So I want you guys to appreciate them then. And lalo na kapag nagpa-fan chant sila, super super natutuwa kami. So I hope you guys won't get weirded out if you hear 
are anong loves na nagpa-fanchant or kahit anong fandom na nagpa-fanchant para sa idol nila kasi it's beautiful. Ang sarap sa ears kapag nagpa-perform kami and nagpa-fanchant kayo. So please, appreciate them, appreciate us, appreciate everyone around you. Say the good things kahit na minsan ay hirapan na tayo. Okay? <laughs> Number four is super important, lalo na ngayong pandemic because hygiene is very very important. So always be presentable and do your basic hygiene. Of course, maligo tayo, toothbrush, and look presentable. Try to wear good clothes that can make you confident kasi, syempre, dagdag pogi at ganda points din yan. Kapag pogi at ganda ka and super presentable, mapapansin ka ni Oshie kasi, you look good! Diba? You look fresh. Naka good vibes kaya makakita na ala, ang cute naman nito. Ala, grabe, ang ganda ng suot. Diba? Kahit kami, kaya namin mag-compliment ng bonggang-bongga sa inyo. If we see something so adorable or so beautiful or amazing, diba? So, kayo din. Do your basic hygiene. Always bring alcohol, lalo na ngayong pandemic. Super importante yun. And sa mga future events, if ever man meron ng mga 48 handshake event, I hope you guys can bring alcohols para bago tayo mag-handshake, ay may alcohol tayo. And of course, Face mask. If you can baon, oh, I'm sorry. If you can baon mouthwash para ma disinfect yung mouth nyo from time to time kapag nasa labas kayo, please do. Because it can help you a lot. But yeah, basic hygiene. Okay? And of course, the last do's ng um, loves or fans. What <laughs> the main members, but yeah. The last do's is, of course, follow the guidelines, follow the rules. Kasi, Kapag kayo mismo yung naglalabag, mahirap para sa amin na sumunod. Kasi kayo mismo naglalabag. And of course, kapag nakikita ng iba na lumalabag ka, they might think it's okay and they might think hindi big deal yung nilalabag nyo kaya itutuloy din nila. So, diba? Let's be a good role model. Let's be nice. <laughs> Let's not do anything na maiistorbo ang ibang tao. And... Yeah, that's basic etiquette. Dapat alam natin makiramdam kung paano tayo mag-act kapag kasama natin ang ibang tao. Especially kapag hindi nyo family or friends kasi hindi nila tayo kalala. Of course, hindi natin pwedeng i-reason lagi na we have personal problems kasi not everyone will understand you. So, follow the rules and the guidelines. Lalo sa mga staff kasi nahihirapan din ang mga staff na Kapag hindi sumusunod, don't take pictures or videos kapag sinabing hindi pwede. Please, please. And if you guys don't know and new fan lang kayo, we're not really allowed to talk to you guys. Unless nasa event tayo, but outside event and sa social media, we can't really talk to you. So, please understand. Okay? Okay, okay magtampo. Kasi mahal namin kayo kahit hindi nyo kami ma-feel um, verbally or personally, ganon. But, I hope you guys know na we appreciate you guys a lot. Super importante nyo sa amin. Wala ang MLO48 kapag walang MLOs. We love you guys. Okay? <laughs> and dito ako para i-assure kayo na mahal na mahal na mahal kayo ng MLO48 and we're trying our best to improve every day to make you guys happy. So, let's move on sa don'ts. Oh my! Ano yung mga don'ts? Hmm! <laughs> But yeah, number one don't is don't expect anything in return. Hindi porket madami kang naambag or nagastos or yun nga, matagal ka nang nagstay sa fandom ay may dapat nakapalit para sa'yo. Of course, we are allowed to show you guys our appreciation sa inyo but syempre, may limitations kasi we have rules. And yun nga, it's really really hard for us to follow things if you guys will be be sad or magtatampo kapag hindi namin ginawa ayun it's better na we have this idol and fan relationship kasi naman mas higit pa because that's the reason why you stand ml 48 ba we are idols and you are a fan and i think that relationship is so beautiful and super alam niyo yun ang precious ang innocent and i want na mas ma intindihan ng normies ang ganung kind of relationship kasi it's, I swear, it's so beautiful supporting someone you don't really know personally and that's 
so nice. You're one of the people who are literally giving us the reason to keep going. It's <laughs> I don't know if you hear it, but yeah. You're one of the reasons kung bakit patuloy pa rin kami na lumalaban para sa mga pangarap namin. And kayo yung pangarap namin. <laughs> Literal, kasi we want Amal Loves, Amal 48 fans to grow because you guys are amazing. And I want to see more people na katulad nyo because you guys are the best. And I love you guys. Super! Super naka touch na makita yung mga smile nyo tuwing events na para sa amin ordinary girl pa rin kami but seeing you guys na nasa starstruck or na e enjoy yung moment kapag nakasama nyo kami super nakaka taba sa puso so just continue being a good fan okay <laughs> number two is don't make unnecessary comments tulad ng Uy, Oshi, ang laki naman ng pimple mo. Uy, Oshi, grabe ang eye bags mo. Uy, Oshi, may ganto ka sa mukha or something. ba? Super naka-insecure kapag lagi niyong pinapoint out. So, it's better na iwasan niyo na lang magsabi ng mga bagay na hindi naman namin ma-fix ng agad-agad. Like pimples. It's part of human body na magka-pimples tayo and we can't really do anything about it. Hindi siya na aayos ng agad-agad. So, if you see something like those things na I mentioned, just shh. <laughs> shh ka na lang. Quiet na lang. Okay? We're aware. Or, lalo na pag BMI. Kasi, ML48 has strict BMI. So, if you notice na medyo tumataba na o siya nyo, huwag nyo na lang sabihan. Kasi, napapansin din namin. And we're trying our best to fix it. Okay? Yeah, let's move on to the second. Second ba? Let's move on to the third one, which is my favorite. Kasi, I'm sure madami sa inyo na nakakalimutan to. Kasi, I don't know you have different priorities. But, for me, ito dapat inuuna nyo. So, number three is, don't forget to prioritize yourself. I want you guys to prioritize yourself. Kasi, you deserve it. You deserve all the love you're giving us. Kasi, alam niyo yun, ang galing-galing niyo. Super sweet, super supportive. I don't know, but para sa akin, kayo yung mga taong gustong-gusto kong makasama kapag namumroblema ako. Kayo yung safe place ko. So, I want you guys to feel the same way. I want you guys to be happy with yourself. I want you guys to be sweet din sa sarili niyo. Take care of yourself. Come on, treat yourself. Good food. Kain lang kayo. It's okay na you treat yourself from time to time. Syempre, wag naman sobra. Basta, if alam niyong nagawa, may nagawa kayong maganda, treat yourself. Come on. Come on. Kara, kain tayo ngayon. Di ba? <laughs> kain kayo, ha? Kain kayo. And... Yeah, I want you guys to prioritize yourself. Lalo na if you guys have family. I want you guys to prioritize your family, sa mga basic needs nyo. You don't have to buy us or give us gifts if kayo mismo na ngailangan. Please, take care of yourself. We're super happy kapag nalalaman namin na you guys treated yourself. If you have achievements, alam niyo yun, parang kami rin mismo gusto namin mag-celebrate with you guys. So, take care. Okay? Stay safe. Number four is super mahirap iwasan, lalo na if hindi nagkakaisa. But, please, please avoid fan wars. Lalo na if there are new fans who are willing to know the group, but some of you guys are scaring them off. <laughs> Be nice. Educate them little by little. Huwag yung bigla-biglaan. Kasi, Knowing 48G system, super dami mong kailangan malaman. And kapag binigay mo siya ng isang bagsakan, feeling ko mararamdaman nila is, hala, ang dami naman alam, ang dami ko naman kailangan aralin, sige, wag na lang, ganun. <laughs> I don't know, for me, I think there are people who are not willing to study the group ng super bilis. I'm sure there are people na gustong malaman yung group slowly but surely. So, let them have their own pace and educate them nicely. 
Huwag niyo napansinin yung mga nangaaway sa atin. Kasi, sino ba sila, di ba? <laughs> Let's mind our own lives and be happy with our achievements. Hindi natin kailangan ipamuka sa kanila na mas angat tayo or mas magaling tayo. Kasi, magaling tayong lahat. And just trust your Oshi and trust the fandom. Ganun lang yun eh. Huwag niyo nang pansinin. Let's move on to the last one. Oh my gosh. Sana... Matupag to in every ways kasi super hirap nito para sa amin and yeah, para sa safety din namin ng mga Oshi nyo or kahit sino na you think are, you know, attractive, ganon. Always know your limits. Do not invade our privacy kasi we need our privacy din. We need our alone time. We need to spend time. We want to spend time with our friends as well with our family. You don't have to add us a personal account namin. You don't have to stalk us or follow us kapag nakita nyo kami. Because it's literally scaring and kapag nangyayari yun, super mahirap. Kasi hindi namin alam kung ano na, ano na mangyayari sa amin next. Kasi hindi naman namin kayo kilala to the personal level to trust you. And we hope you guys understand that. But yeah, I hope na may wasan natin na invade yung privacy ng bawat isa sa atin. Because it's very important. Okay? Always know your limits. Always know how to treat people correctly. And treat us nicely. Treat the people around you nicely. It's always better to be known as nice and humble and sweet. Kesa naman mayabang, stalker, di ba? It's bad. It's bad, 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 bad. So, always, always be nice. Okay? Okay. <laughs> okay, so we're done with this vlog. Oh my gosh, congratulations. I hope you guys learned a lot of things. And sana nasusunod nyo, or masusunod nyo sa mga susunod nyong um, chapter. Wow, chapter sa, sa story nyo. Okay? We're gonna have a beautiful journey. Basta alam natin kung ano yung tama at mali. And I'm really excited to be with you guys until the end. So, make me your Oshi, and I'll be your Hoshi that can light up your whole world. Maraming salamat sa panonood ng vlog na to. Happy Sunday! Bye!